my good friends and welcome back to my channel or if you are new here my name is Tia and I live in a self-built tiny house and I have decided to come and clean my tiny house so I'm gonna do like a spring clean because I haven't been here the whole winter and I haven't been cleaning and I've been walking here with shoes on everywhere and my dog as well so there's sand everywhere and so now I'm gonna clean all the dust and the sand and organize some things and start planning my move here and how to decorate and all that stuff so that is the plan what are you doing you saying hi Becca oh hello hello so that's the plan for the day is to start a fire in the fireplace, start cleaning, probably listen to some audiobook while I do all that and then I'm gonna have my lunch here, maybe drink some tea if I brought enough water for everything for my dog and for the tea and the cleaning um, because there's no running water uh, I'm not even going to try if the water is running because I know that the pipe is still frozen. It's surprisingly warm at the tiny house. Let's check. Um, yeah, wow. It's like, uh, it's about 12 or 13 Celsius. So yeah, that's great. I won't be needing to heat place that much claimed that the transition from the human level to the next level because they were all in the church. The terminology. It's PTSD to me. just got all my stuff from the main house here and I don't like I can't believe how much stuff I have and it's not like I took all of this to the main house at the same time when I went there to spend the winter but it's more like that I took all the necessary things and then little by little I came to the tiny house to pick something up like if I was going to the city I was like oh I want to wear that thing and I grabbed it from here and oh I want to do that kind of art and I grabbed the supplies from here and I just never returned them and now there's just so much stuff that I brought here all at once but yeah pretty much now like everything is here except for some of the stuff from the fridge and the freezer so like the food things are still a little bit in the main house I got something here but I will need to do a second run those things but yeah now I'm gonna put everything kind of in its place Draw wisdom from many different places. If we 
take it from only one place, it becomes rigid and stale. Understanding others, the other elements, and the other nations will help you become whole. be the first night that I will spend in my tiny house this spring so I have officially moved back in the fireplace is going it's warm and cozy or oh, it's getting warm and cozy it's not quite warm enough yet um, but yeah I basically just unpacked everything and now I can just enjoy my Friday night and I got pizza and some chocolate to watch a movie in bed. I'm so excited. I'm so excited to be back in my tiny house. Lake Royale is a heavenly place, so full of beauty. I think I have been staying in the tiny house for a week now and it really started to look like spring when I arrived but now, well, guess again yeah. yeah, what a lovely finished spring day it's currently um, like 28th of March or something like that um, yeah. Where are we heading? Beautiful sunny day. Hello! So me and my friend Vince are trying to find this like devil's field, like field full of rocks that I have been trying to find for like maybe 10 times already and I never find it. So let's hope that this time uh, we actually might find it because it would be really interesting to see. We are at like 
very near my house this at this local viewpoint we just went there and now we're trying to find the field oh my god guys we found it what and it was like so nearby i don't know how i didn't find this before like a viewpoint. Let's see if we can find that now. The adventure continues. That's where we were planning to go and my guest actually did, but I just tipped my toes in because it's so cold. Ooh. Oh. Ooh. You would like to go, wouldn't you? You would love, love, love to go swimming. You kind of accidentally did. Yep. Right there. I wasn't able to go, but I did. I did get my toes a little bit deeper this time than the first time. Now back to sauna for a bit and then then we'll go back to the tiny house. Some yellow? Maybe, yeah. Hello everyone, I am feeling good today. I wanted to put some makeup on. Uh, I made this uh, very like spring kind of look. Even made little fake freckles because of that. What the heck, why not? I'm not going anywhere really, but like I just wanted to celebrate just this day. Oh, thank God. But anyway, yeah, a lot has happened since the last um, time I spoke to you guys here on this channel. Um, so I wanted to give a little update on this vlog, like what's going on. Um, you saw me on this video t when I moved back to my tiny house and actually after that uh, we got a lot of snow in Finland, like a proper winter. So I kind of moved back to the main house and then 
my parents came back home so I was with them in the main house and I just didn't come back for the uh, for the tiny house and then I had like a little trip with my aunt to Estonia just like a one night there and I decided I'll move back to the tiny house after that trip but then it was like the craziest spring storm like super windy so I thought why bother I can just still spend a few more nights in the main house so that's what I did and then I got my couch surfing friend to stay here uh, almost for a week so then we did come to this tiny house and since then I have stayed here so uh, I put a few clips from while he was here visiting Finland and um, now like I'm finally settled back in the tiny house I got my running water and it's just been a bit warmer like I only have to heat the place maybe once a day or sometimes twice a day um, depending a bit of the weather how it's outside and while my couchsurfing friend was here visiting Finland it was actually really warm like super warm almost like a t-shirt weather outside uh, for Finns anyway <laughs> now it got a bit colder again um, it's currently raining as well, which I don't mind, like I really like the spring rain, but it is a bit chillier. Um, not in my tiny house, I'm wearing a top because I made the fire in the morning, so it's quite nice and toasty here. Unfortunately, there's no update on the van, like I haven't done anything for the van since January, and I'm thinking that I kind of want to build the bathroom in my tiny house before renovating the van but we'll see like all the plans are open oh can you hear the rain it's the metal roof that it's making it pretty loud hopefully it's okay anyway that's kind of what's been going on lately in the past month or so since i last posted a video and um uh, next week I'm going to London with my brother, so I'm really excited for that trip. I'm not sure if I will be filming it, maybe something, but I haven't decided what kind of uh, video I want to make from, from that trip and how much I want to carry all these filming equipments and stuff, because we only have like tiny backpacks on this trip. It's like uh, four days or five days or something. But yeah, that's happening. I think I'm gonna end the vlog here and I want to thank you for being here and watching this video um, Let me know how your spring has started in the comments or what book you're currently reading or um, I would like to know. I'll actually I can show you what book I'm currently reading and finishing in a moment I'm currently reading the throne of class which I'm enjoying way more than I was actually expecting. I didn't really know anything about this book when I started reading it, just that a lot of YouTubers have been speaking about this. And But yep, I am hooked and I definitely want to continue this series. Thank you for watching and I will see you next time. Bye!